Well, you may have seen a post warning people not to respond if you receive a text message like this one. It comes from various unknown phone numbers with a picture of a girl. The viral post claims it's a form of sex trafficking and that if you respond, your location can be tracked. Our Paula Soro looked into the claims and separates fact from fiction. You've probably heard of Anna Delvey who tricked people out of millions of dollars. She's either a rich German heiress or she's flat broke. Or the so-called Tinder swindler who conned women out of money. $30,000. $140,000. Experts warning these text messages sent out to people nationwide are scams, just like those two true stories. And it all starts on an app or it all starts through a text message. Scammers are going where people are. The Better Business Bureau says it's received reports of these texts coming from different phone numbers with the same picture of this girl. This post, which has been shared more than 250,000 times, claims it's a form of sex trafficking and that if you reply, they can track you. Delete it. Forget about it. Don't worry. Don't respond. It's the newest way to scare people. But cybersecurity specialist Ron Pierce says answering comes with risks. They want you to respond because it validates your phone number. They can sell that number to advertisers and say, hey, this is legit, and they'll make money off of that. If they get the conversation going far enough, they can get personal information off of you. Potentially leading to an identity theft situation, a romance scam or phishing scam, says Simone Williams with the BBB. We're seeing that younger adults, you know, 18 to 35, are getting scammed at the same rate or more than, you know, older generations. When they say, hey, you trust me, then you start telling like personal things about yourself. So the text messages are real. Even two of my colleagues have received them. But experts say the claims about sex trafficking and tracking a location are not. It's more of a, a bot that's actually sending out the text. And then once someone begins to reply and respond to it, then a human kind of picks up and takes over. 